Hello guys, welcome back to Serial File with me, Sam. Today we have some new cereals that I just found um, at the grocery store here in Mexico. Yay! So these are actually um, another version of the cereals I very recently reviewed with Ali. We did the Pops version of the Choco Krispies and we did the regular Puffs or Pops version of the Nesquik cereal, which has always been like those shapes. Uh, I had mentioned previously that this is the Cocoa Puffs cereal that we have. <laughs> it's the same type of cereal or it tastes exactly the same, but we have it as Nesquik from Nestle here in Mexico. So they have these new versions. We've got the Nesquik, but we have letter shapes. So kind of like alphabets, um, letritas we can see here. So we're gonna have some chocolate alphabets, I guess. And we have Choco Crispies with M&M's minis in them. So they just put some M&M's minis in there, which coincidentally I found to be the same as these. Uh, these are Rice Krispies treats. I just got these as well. And they have, they are, sorry, um, of course, the Cocoa Krispies version. And they've got M&M's minis in them. So I'm expecting this cereal to be the same as these Rice Krispies treats. It, it should be the same thing. Um, so yes, we are excited, of course, to try this out. Um, hmm. I think I wasn't going to say anything, <laughs> anything else. Uh, there we go. Okay. I want to start with these, um, being maybe the less intense flavor. I assume it's going to be less intense. Uh, I should have pre-opened this. Okay, so interesting bag. It's a, like a tin foil, something. Okay, very chocolatey smell, really good. And we can see the letters. Ah, they're so cute. Of course, and as expected, um, a lot of them are bits, <laughs> pieces of letters. I'll make a close up there. But um, they are so much thinner than I expected them to be. I thought they were going to be a little bit thicker um, or just maybe heavier, but no, they're like really, really thin letters. And here we go. Hmm. Oh. They do not taste like the the Nesquik cereal, the Cocoa Puffs cereal. Mm. They taste, I don't even know, like kind of chocolatier, but not sweet at all. They're just not sweet. Mm. <laughs> mm. I really enjoyed the texture. It's really good, but I have to say this cereal really surprised me because, well, as you might have tried out before, Cocoa Puffs, it's the same cereal as the Nesquik. And it is pretty sweet. It's chocolatey, it's sweet, but this one was completely lacking sugar or the sweetness. Um, it even says less sugar here, menos azúcar. And instead of less, I think it should say absolutely no sugar. <laughs> there was nothing, it was not sweet at all. So I did get like a very chocolatey or like a cocoa flavor, but absolutely no sugar, no sweetness in this. So the flavor was kind of disappointing um, but if you don't have much of a sweet tooth, this one would be a, this would be a perfect cereal for you. 
Um, so I'm gonna have to give this for flavor. Um, uh, a five. It's not sweet at all. So yeah, five. Um, texture. I really enjoyed it. Um, I really like the the little letters. Um, and how thin it was, it was actually good. I think it was much better. Not, not super crunchy or like scraping <laughs> anything in there, so that's great. Um, I like this texture. It would get soggy in a bit. My, cho my chocolate. My milk got really chocolatey. Yeah, with just that little tiny tasting. So um, I'm gonna say, I'll give it an eight. For texture it's pretty good and presentation well that was absolutely expected like all the or most of the letters to be just like bits of them um, little pieces broken so and they don't really look as pretty as the ones we have in the picture so therefore yeah I'm gonna give it a they really tried though. I'm gonna give it a seven for presentation, for IRL. Um, it's not bad, okay. But yeah, I mean, come on. There's no sweet flavor in here. I feel I was kind of generous with that five. But okay, let's hope this one is really sweet because if it has got some M&M's minis in here. So excited about these. Um, I don't know, I've never really put M&M's in, in a cereal before, so I am hoping to see, oh, oh my god, I can barely see a few M&M's in there, so that's not cool. I think I should have, I should have bought my own M&M's minis and poured them in there. Oh, damn. I pour the bag. Okay. It does smell like M&M's though. Okay, I just poured... Um, oh my god. I just poured some cereal and I saw like three or four M&M's minis, but just in this little kind of handful that I took, there are four. You can't really see the, the darker ones because of the cereal color but you can see blue and orange in there. So, well, that's cool. I'm gonna make sure that's in my spoon, in my first spoonful at least. Okay, so we're ready to try this out. Here we go. Hmm. It's, it's pretty good. I mean, it's regular Choco Krispies. Mm. Which is a good chocolatey cereal. And if you're lucky, you'll get an M&M in there, which tastes perfect. M&Ms are great. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Well, completely as expected, the M&M's will sink to the bottom of the bowl and you have to fish for them. Um, and of course they start to, um, I guess, lose their color. <laughs> so they, they can paint your milk um, orange and blue, green. And they're like, it happens when you put M&M's in, in ice cream, right? So um, yeah, that was actually fun, I guess, but it's not amazing. I mean, I got probably seven M&M's minis in there. So I really wish there were, I don't know, like half and half, 50% M&M's, 50% um, Krispies. I do want to show you this this Rice Krispies treat with M&M's minis because this one does have pretty much like 
a full or most most of it will give you some M&M's minis in there. So that was kind of like what I was expecting, like just to have more in here, not as few as we did get. Um, so for flavor, I mean, this is a really chocolatey cereal and it is pretty good. It's Cocoa Krispies. Um, I'm gonna give it, um, well, because of the M&M idea, I'm gonna give it an eight. Mm -hmm, because it does improve the flavor. Um, texture, texture is great when, when we get crispies, they are amazing. So I really enjoy them, but they do get super soggy. You have to eat them real quick. Uh, therefore, I would give it uh, an eight as well for texture. I do really enjoy that crunch, crunchy, crispy. And for presentation, the in, the IRL presentation, um, definitely we don't get as many M&M's minis as we see in this picture or as we would expect. So yeah, I'm gonna have to say seven, <laughs> seven. Yeah, um, it would look much better with more and it would taste much better with more. So that's all for today. Let me just try this. Oh, they're really good. Mm -hmm. That's all for today. Um, really excited that we got some new cereals here in Mexico. Hopefully you find these in a grocery store near you soon enough. Um, and don't forget to like, subscribe. Thank you guys so much for joining me on this chocolatey journey. And I'll see you next time. Bye.